Dawn Arm is gonna be a commentator too. Nice. It should be. Okay, we are live. I might as well send the announcement here. Now, that sounds bad. You put it. You put it in announcements. Um, typing it in. No, it's this map. <laughs> uh, ah, yeah. yes, of course, the background is definitely the people dying. Uh, anyways, I believe this map is called Vivid 34. It's the shortest available map. Not the shortest, but one of the shortest 5 star maps. Usually, what you can use to get the 5 star medal. Definitely knew that. Definitely, definitely knew that he was banning. <clears throat> yeah. This is what happens when you commentate and try to type things at the same time.
with the claimed day again. Change the stream title. Yeah, of course. I used to wonder why people never change stream titles. Now I understand how easy it is to forget. Both players are seeing those, but it's a clear accuracy lead. And of course, as I say that, lucky from this is it's not my fault, man. Don't blame me. Ah, uh, yeah, that would be nice. Entirety of the ending. Definitely visibly shifting. Oh, and I think it was supposed to be the end of that seal of the deal. Saki Fan had a pretty unfortunate miss right there. I think if he kept it up, he might have been able to take the point there. Oh, and spread nuts goes for easy one. Let's go. plays a bit of everything he says. Yeah, well that's not untrue. He is Furness is quite the all-rounder. Maybe the one gap in skill being flashlight which which is such a rare skill anyways.
but that's very comfortable on this stick as a thing. Quarter way through the map so far. Rakitan not so lucky it seems. I suppose for anyone who has any amount of experience with Muzi, this would be an almost sure win. That was a very, well, that was quite a comfortable win for Spurnets, looking at the scores. Sakisan goes with Nomad 1, the RNG pick. I say RNG because this one could honestly go either way. As it is in pretty much every match in every tournament, unless there's a clear huge skill gap. Very topical song as R slash place has just concluded. Hime Hime. of being a commentator. I wasn't even finished saying uh, no one is what do you The world it? decided it didn't even need you to say everything else. Yeah, indeed. We're seeing the same old pattern of Spadnuts having higher accuracy. Let's see if he will miss past the middle of the map as usual. I'll be the one to get him to miss if you want me to do it. <laughs> uh, he, As we all know, I have the commentator's curse. Yeah, you do, but are you stronger than Threadness is the question. 
that the will of spread is pretty hard to conquer. I'm not gonna. It's pretty. I'm not gonna lie. Overall, players are doing pretty good in these patterns, but uh, that just seems to be getting the better accuracy on here. Yeah, we have about 500k with this 350k. It'd be difficult for Pakistan to come back at this point. Yeah, it's pretty one-sided. Overall, I, I would say Pakistan is still doing a solid performance, despite it being really one-sided. Yeah, he has—he still has the oneness so far. And spread that's over here, still with the FC. Um, they're at the break. Now they can see each other's scores. Damn, it would be a real shame if we did a bit of trolling. <laughs> <laughs> uh, indulge me in some trolling. I wonder if uh, spreadness of nerves plus your curse can actually get into this before the end of the map. Yo, I got you. Spreadness with a pretty good FC so far. It would It'd be a real shame if he missed right here. Oh man, we're, all, we're already at the end of the map. Not enough time to cause. Yeah, even. I don't, I don't, I don't think I can beat it. spread nuts as well. Overall, solid performance on both sides, but spread nuts just, you know, he's being spread nuts. Yo, say Zoxy, you really had to rat me out like that. You throwing me under the bus now? <laughs> yeah, it's entirely your fault, not mine. I didn't say anything. <laughs> this is all on you now. <laughs> Damn. That's probably why see, I usually always two miss no my ones. <laughs> Dude, the, I, I just reverse commentators cursed him. That's what happened. Yeah, you you just help them instead. Spreadness has chosen DT2, his, well, I won't say his specialty, but he does play more DT than anything else. Against any other player, no mod one would have been a very solid pick for Saki san, but unfortunately he's up against speed number two. Quite a clear advantage with that 98% of C on spread not to side. Yeah, 
you can almost have seen though with about 85% accuracy even though he did have an early break but I missed it, didn't catch it Accuracy is entirely catching Spreadnuts here who's almost at a million points at this point Saki-san finds a break, I'm lucky Yeah, well I, I suppose the win yeah. goes to Spreadnuts Congrats on Spreadnuts for the win Alright, well, GG's all around. Indeed, GG's. That was actually a pretty nice performance from Pakistan, considering yes. he was playing against Seed 1. Yeah. Well, Seed 2, I mean, not Seed 1. Overall, solid performance on both players. Yeah, let's see who's playing against who next. I think it's me and Saris. Oh yeah, you you guys do have a match next. The next match is about in about forty Thanks. minutes, which is Bunkers versus Decay. Uh, Spreadnuts will go on to face Raviklia, and Sakisan will face Daniel in the losers bracket. Ah yes, okay, well, it was a nice match. Yep. I guess we can end the stream here now. Thanks folks for joining. We have another match in 40 minutes. Yeah, we do. So, see you guys later. See ya.